is up, Gaster Nation? We're out here at uh, Funny Car Chaos in Denton, Texas. We're going to start driving away. We're the fast, go faster, and it's going to get quick, fast, loud, and crazy. Greg Thomas, they call me Smalls, it's a 1954 Chevrolet, it's got a 400 small block in it, running on automatic, I'm an outlaw, it a uh, third generation driver, my dad Tommy Thomas taught me everything and got through it, I used to chase a big time racing, but it was way too unaffordable, so and I got five kids, so I stepped down a notch, went to the gassers, had more fun, to be honest with you, it's the best group of people bar none anywhere in the United States. Today this is our fifth funny car event for the year. Uh, it's a real good turnout. Uh, we have more than 30 funny cars and a combination of gassers, hot rods, and super stock in our class. We're expecting about uh, 60 cars. Awesome. Yeah, yeah. Heavy on the gasser. Absolutely. Yeah. and see some of these awesome super stalkers, gassers, and hot rods that the Dirty South gassers have brought. And uh, take a look at some of the outlaw big tire cars, meet the uh, crews and drivers, and talk to them about these awesome hot rods that they have brought to Funny Car Chaos here this weekend. Hey there, my name's David Ratton. I'm the voice in the chaos at Funny Car Chaos. And boy, what a hit this has been. Whether you choose to run a an injected Hemi or a supercharged Chevy or run, run pop in the tank or run methanol. It's uh, it's your own brand of racing here in Funny Car Chaos. And uh, you know, with the gassers, I mean, sometimes they're primer, sometimes they're patina, sometimes they're paint, and but they're all cool. And they're all somebody's pride and joy.
heart transplant here at the race, I don't know. Yeah. Now nah, they'll get it together. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I say they'll make it happen, so you gotta do what you gotta do. You gotta make sure you're clear. Yeah. You gotta be wild. As long as those boats are straight, anyway. Yeah, well, keep the wheels in the air most yeah. of the way, you don't, you don't need it that much. I think that's a lot of our issue. What's up, Gasser Nation? Sorry it's been a couple weeks since I put out a video. Been insanely busy. I've been uh, 500 miles to Denton, Texas, 500 miles to South Carolina, or 600 miles to South Carolina, uh, through 250 miles to Atmore, Alabama. We've been to a ton of events the past few weeks, and I just haven't had time to edit a video and get it put up for you guys. But I'm back now. It's a little bit less busy. There's still a few more events coming up. But the great news is I got tons of great footage for you guys, lots of awesome racing and uh, and some other stuff, cool shop tours and stuff like that coming up. So be sure to subscribe below if you haven't already and uh, stay tuned because we're getting back on this one video a week at least train, maybe more. Uh, we'll have some more stuff, maybe some funny car videos and stuff like that coming and uh, try to mix it up a little bit. But uh, yeah, this event in Denton, Texas is Funny Car Chaos, and uh, our friends at uh, Dirty South Gassers, um, there's a bunch of really cool cars out in Texas, Oklahoma, that whole area that run uh, in between rounds of the funny cars at Funny Car Chaos. Funny Car Chaos is an incredible event. Um, I highly encourage you to make it, even if it's just for the funny cars. But the cool thing is there's gassers too. So uh, so this is my second one, and I uh, thoroughly enjoyed it, and uh, you guys stay tuned and check out a little bit, some highlights of the gasser racing there, and we're going to do a Funny Car Chaos Funny Car video too, so stay tuned for that one as well.
One more thing before I let you guys go. I really just wanted to give a moment to uh, give a shout out to Chantel Nation of Dirty South Gassers. Um, I went over there to film this event and had a new piece of equipment that I hadn't tried out yet and was dumb enough to get out there and try it without listening back to any of my footage, a new microphone. And uh, turns out all my footage was garbage. All the audio on it was just horrible. So not even usable. So she sent me everything that she got of the event too. So I mixed my good stuff with her awesome stuff and um, we were able to put this video together but uh, without her I, it would have been kind of a bust but either way I had a great time at the event I will definitely be back and uh, and just want to give her a shout out real quick because she really kind of kind of saved the day on the uh, video footage part of it so